Good evening, and welcome to the dailies. You know, the uh, following is a series of outtakes and tests and such. Rick was wonderful on the set because uh, it was a long shoot, and his the star's attitude is very important, and he had a wonderful attitude. I'm not sure why he did this. I think he probably blew the lip sync and said, the heck with it. <laughs> um, this compilation was made by, I don't know who it was made by, not by me. Um, this is the day that uh, Chris came in to work. Excuse me, I couldn't help noticing that strange and interesting plant. What is it? Oh, it's an orchard too. I've never seen anything like it before. No one has. Where did you get it? Well... You remember that total eclipse of the sun about a week ago? Yes. Well. Yes. Continue, young man. <laughs> uh, these girls actually, you know, about six feet above them, there was a large ring, so they supposedly no, couldn't get wet, but unfortunately they got wet. I like to have a good time on the set. Uh, I think for a comedy, in a way, and musical, certainly, um, uh, you have to create an atmosphere of fun. Here, Steve, um, I didn't know this, but Steve was doing a playback, and uh, the sound man edited it up, and this is a surprise to him. It was just for fun. Oh, my God! What did she say? Suddenly! He had no idea what was going on here. So when you're shooting as a crew and you get to be brothers and sisters and you just decide just to have fun together and because it's such a hard job shooting a movie and you want to enjoy each other. Now, and this is the scene where he, where he uh, tried to stop the doors from closing with his hands, and you'll see this is where he cut his hand. Falls off the motorcycle! I'm clumsy, Doctor, I'm clumsy! That hurt. And the relationship that Rick and Vince had was wonderful. They really had a wonderful relationship. And they would support each other and they would also crack, crack each other up. The Audrey 2 is not a healthy girl. Strictly between us, neither is the Audrey 1. Only I knew what Breeder was. Who cares what Breeder is? Look what it's done for business. I know. So work, Seymour. Nurse this plant back to death. To death. <laughs> And the crew was very supportive, too. They really enjoyed all these actors. We had a lot of fun. I think when a thing is a bigger challenge, you have to have more fun, because otherwise you'd kill each other. <laughs> but it's so tough, and we had a great time. The girls here, Michelle, Tisha, and Tashina, were wonderful. That was Christmas we shot through. We took off of Christmas. That was the Christmas period of, of the year we shot through. This is Robbie Merkin with Tashina. Robbie was the actual musical director of the off-Broadway production and also of the movie. I'm not sure what that was. <laughs> okay. What film is this? We also played ping pong a great deal in the set, so that'll be a motif in, in, uh, in these outtakes. You'll see um, and hear ping pong a great deal. Oh, Seymour, we gotta get. I forgot my lines. <laughs> 505, take 10. French clap. This is very nerve wracking. Oh, nice People go mad. Uh, yeah. A fence. A real chain link. A grill out on the patio. Look at the, look at the artistic swing that Bob's. Not everyone can do that. You know? These are all little bits and pieces that someone put together. Now, here is a scene where they kept on cracking each other up, so I couldn't do over the shoulders. I had to go in for close ups. <laughs> Everything. The, pick, the word pickup reminds me of it now. Of course. You'd have to teach me how to take care of it while you're away. Give me your secret gardening tips. He couldn't get through it. It's just, they were just cracking up on anything now. Back to action. Ready? Come closer. <laughs> action. <laughs> Stop it! And Death! <laughs> Camera running, here we go. Ready? And action. 
Tonight? I can't. Go. <laughs> That's a dream sequence that we shot and never used. But listen to the ping pong ball sound effects in the background. That's a couple of crew members. A vine is coming into my dress? More, more. Anyway, the ping pong was indicative of how often we played ping pong off the set while we prepared shots. I, I don't know if I should. Hey, little lady, be nice. Do you talk to Seymour like this? Sure do, I'll bring you straight. Last take, guys. And we shot through Easter. on the floor a long time holding out and they, the legs became numb. Okay, here we go. I probably have around two takes left. Oh, but I'll stop and it'll be easier. Come join your ditches friend and mush me. <laughs> That's just a joke that they edited together. It wasn't even part of the movie. Yeah, <laughs> well, uh, I'm happy, so I want to just do one more take. Again, ping pong. The entire crew played ping pong incessantly. So that was just a joke on Rick. And Rick also played ping pong. Now the pods over here, when you do the ahs, come forward to camera if you can a few inches. On These were scanned in pods. Because we didn't want to use the real ones for rehearsal. This was an accident, not meant to happen. Nature calls! You got the point? I'm gonna bust your balls! <laughs> he was a great sport, Rick was. Clock! Door! Fridge! What are you laughing? <laughs> I was not. Okay, are we rolling? Yeah, cut. We're still running. No, cut. Yeah. Can cut. Yeah. Cut. 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 I'll get it. <laughs> me, me. The sequel! What about the sequel? That was just some crew having fun. It was really a wonderful performance. However, I just have a couple of suggestions. I hope you don't mind me suggesting to you. Yeah. It was my, it they was just my laid my audio over the shot as a joke. I'm like, I think, I think as I recall, 11 years ago or 10 years ago, this was an entire joke reel they showed at the cast party, as I recall. So uh, it was a surprise to me when they did it, and it's a surprise to me as I look at it now. I've forgotten so much of it, but I do remember how much fun we had.